Ini luas deh, hai. Hai. Oke. Okay. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, it is going to be a vlog. Yay, it's my baby's birthday. He's a year old today. I'm so grateful to God. It's been such such um a learning experience it's been such a you know life-changing experience and um this is my very first vlog and you know i'm just quite excited to see how this um vlog goes because it's the very first so i'll be showing you guys just the um little bits of things i've done i've had a photo shoot this morning and it was just like this very cute thing i'll insert like pictures and videos here and yeah it had so much fun it was so chillax you guys know that thing they always say about first birthdays that babies are usually very cranky it's been the opposite for him i'm so grateful to god because i was just like i don't want that to happen so yeah he's been quite chilled he's just you know enjoying air all the attention the pictures and all of that so yeah i'm so grateful to god for that um E, um yeah yeah so today i'm just having a few friends over um for a barbecue ignore the fact that i have one hearing on the ear it's just because my baby has actually it literally like pulled the hearing out so yeah um that's what is happening today um, I've got a little barbecue set up outside already. My husband had, had all that set up. Um, and yeah, I'm so excited to see how this vlog goes. I'll show you guys the cake we had made. Oh, I can't switch the camera. I'll just insert a video later. So I'll show you guys the cake we had made. I decided on Baby Shark because it loves Baby Shark. Anytime he hears Baby Shark, he literally starts dancing. He literally starts dancing. So yeah, I'm so grateful to God for this journey. You know, it's been amazing. I've learned so much about myself. Even the period of the maternity leave that um, being pregnant afforded me was such a blessed time. You know, I had such a, I don't know, like it was almost like a retreat. It was almost like a, um, like a time out for me to just take time out, focus on what is important and then gather my energy back before I go back into work. So I'm so grateful to God for that period and just this um period. Yeah, I'm just grateful to God for it. So yeah, um you know what you want to say hi. Hi. <laughs> it waves like a queen. <laughs> <coughs> to keep up so yeah um we are having a little barbecue a few friends over i have a little out outfit here that is going to be wearing i'll do a little video as well and just insert it here um yeah it has the suspenders and like short thing is going to be wearing it's so cute so yeah it's going to be wearing that um and yeah i'm just I'm so grateful to God. I'm so grateful. It's been such a year. Okay. So, yeah. It's been such a, a learning year. And you know, oh my goodness. I, I was going to film an, entire, an entirely different video for this particular um, um, topic that I'm about to touch on. And, you know, just resuming back to work for the first time. How the experience was. I was going to film a video on that, um, but I think I'll just get on. It. I'll get on with it in this video. So on the first day after I resumed back to work, you guys know how it is. You've been off work for like a year, so you know I've been preparing my mind. Like, okay, you're going to work. You're going to have to leave your baby at home, and um, you're going to have to like get used to you know not being at home anymore, but still you know trusting whoever you have placed your baby in their care to look after him well. And, you know, just the first day of resuming back to work, I literally, as I was about to get down from the car, I started crying. You guys, you wouldn't believe it. Like, I totally, like, I, I, sometimes I feel as if I'm one hard guy, but <laughs> hard guy no hard anything. I literally bawled. Like, I just started crying. Like, I was just like, oh. And, you know, it was so innocent because it was staying with, was it staying with his dad? It was with his dad. His dad was in the car. And it was so innocent. He had no idea that he wasn't going to see me all day. After being with me like 24-7 for the past, 
like a year obviously <laughs> so you know i just felt like how is, how is that going to be for him and all of that so um i just started thinking about it and i was crying and obviously because like you know resuming back to work it's like a whole new place you have to like get your mind there mentally you have to like get yourself there like just make up your mind to like enter into this uh, you know this new season again because it's different as to when when i was there before i was working before i was i was single okay i was married but you know pregnant but i wasn't I didn't have a baby i wasn't like responsible for another human being and you know i don't know whether i'm being dramatic here but that that was the matter do you want to say hello to the people again say hello dada say hi hi so i don't know whether i'm being dramatic but that was literally my experience because i i just i just uh, the experience was just different you know and yeah i'm i'm over it now because i'm getting used to it and what life looks like now with having um a toddler now and just having to look after him and still work and balance life basically yeah i've been rambling um, before so before i just ended there i was going to just say a couple of things that can help you if you are going back to work and even off mat off on maternity leave just a few tips as well that can like just tide you over you know i think one of the most important things that i had to figure out was just you know like just getting used to it like getting your mind in in the space that you're going to be resuming work again so you have to like get your mind ready <laughs> So as I was saying, one of the things that I really believe would be of help to you, that will be useful to you, if you are resuming back to work after being off on maternity leave, would be just getting your mind ready in that space. And um, if you are still, secondly, if you are still like breastfeeding, I would suggest you like just make sure you reduce it, or at least you are pumping it if you are still if you still want to keep on breastfeeding. Just so you have like a routine and your breast doesn't start to get like swollen when you get back to work because i first decided i was still going to continue breastfeeding on resuming back to work um but you know just without things turned out i just changed my mind and i decided to just stop breastfeeding altogether so you know you know how it is when you stop breastfeeding your breast like swells up and it hurts so i had to just experience that while i was at work so if you can avoid um pushing it that long before you stop do to be like a lifesaver for you um another tip is just that you know like just don't be too don't be too hard on yourself like if you feel emotions it's normal it's okay like obviously so just don't allow it to like weigh you down feel it process it like if you want to cry cry it out you know and get a move on if you're right literally like the minute you just acknowledge the emotions don't try to just push them to decide as if they are not existent and you'll be good so yeah the other thing is i know like i feel like one of my one of my one of my friend's sisters she actually really really advised me on this but i didn't go through with it because she kept saying that i should make sure that i start to take in Yuluwa to wear that's a baby's name Yuluwa Jida. that she started to take him to um wherever i would want him to be going while i'm at work that she just started to take him there but i didn't do that i just you know because of the covid and i just didn't want to be a bother on anyone like that so um he he he, he cried he cried a bit um on his first um visit to the house that i was going to be in but it's fine it's fine it's fine you get used to it it's just a matter of time so yeah um returning back to work has been different it has just been it has been a new space but i'm really grateful because i'm i'm like i had this mind mind i, I was kind of i was prepared i'll not lie my mind was prepared and no matter how much um how much i still feel like emotional no matter how prepared you are you still experience the emotions that come so don't deny them don't deny them and yeah just give yourself a pat on the back you're doing a good job okay 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 all right so um 
yeah it's been nice chatting with you guys i think i like this vlog style so yeah i think i like this vlog style they are really like easy i don't know i feel like it's way easier than sitting down and setting up the tripod and all of that just to carry the camera and film yourself not bad i might be doing more of these vlogs yeah because it's quite i like it i like it so yeah um and we just carry on to the rest of the day and see how things go okay so here is the cake um i got this baby shark cake from a friend of ours that bakes and the, here is just a couple of cards we got these from our neighbor oh lean she's so nice um yeah and that's from his dad so um yeah you guys see this cake in the picture we took earlier when i inserted it and yeah so yeah this is his um, outfit this white t-shirt this suspenders with the shorts and the hat that he's holding on to <laughs> Right guys, we're going to get ready now. Hi guys, we've got our little outfit on. It looks so cute. So cute. Um, I'm quickly popping over to friends, please. Our and um, my baby's birthday is today as well. And um we're just going to be taking a couple of pictures together. Yeah, so we'll be popping over there. Carry that. Thank you, boy. No error Look here. <laughs> absolutely inspired absolutely moved by god absolutely motivated by the spirit absolutely propelled by eternal life on point in step in time in order in shape with you a decade of vision when i see you moving i move when i see you stopping i stop I want nothing more in my life but to be in step with you, God. Hi. Hi. Say hello to mommy. Go. 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 Zuzu. Zi mama. She wants to come. Mama, do you want to say hello? Zoe. Zoe. <laughs> hey, gorgeous. <laughs> hi, guys. Welcome. Okay, not hi, guys. So it is about. Um, to eight to, to nine now yeah 20 minutes to nine actually 25 minutes to nine and our last guest left about 15 minutes ago so yeah we've had a nice chilled out and it's just nice seeing everyone again you know with everything that has happened so yeah um it's been an awesome day i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and i hope you enjoyed just chatting with me today in this kind of relaxed setting i think i'm going to do more of these kind of videos they're quite easy to do and just yeah um so it incorporated to a maximum extent until we started crying later when we we're trying to take pictures and everyone kept saying cheese i think it's weirded him out and just hearing people shout like cheese at once like that so but aside from that, it was pretty chilled. It was, yeah, it was pretty chilled for a one-year birthday. So, so grateful to God. Um, so grateful to all the amazing support system I've had this one year. Just, you know, in my mom group. Not that we have an, it's not like we have an official group, but there are some people that have called so much in the past one year. <laughs> they they're just my go-to people to call and you know they just provide wisdom they provide some you know just consolation to know that what you're experiencing is not like in isolation so yeah i've really enjoyed having that um community and i hope to continue to foster them and to continue to grow and you know just just growing in the knowledge of god just growing 
in this role of parenting um, in collaboration with God over our children. And yeah, I'm just so happy. I'll see you guys in my next one. Love you so much. Bye. Happy birthday. Let us see. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. Hooray! No boundary, no boundary. I see it, I see it all around, all around. There's no limits, no limits, no boundaries, no boundaries. I see it, I see it. See?